approaching five dollars a gallon. What's causing the record cost and what's being done to drive prices down? A live report just ahead. And analysts also believe we're going to reach six dollars a gallon by Labor Day. Now, when you talk about the factors that might be driving up prices, they're not going away anytime soon. Many folks might assume it's because of the European Union ratcheting up sanctions against Russian imports of oil and gas. Some 90 percent of those are going to be blocked by the end of 2022. But it's a combination of factors. So many families in America are hitting the road again right now. Demand is high for the summer travel season. On top of that, guys, oil producers have contracted their staffing by tens of thousands of employees, shut down wells because because during the pandemic, demand all but vaporized, but our economy has come roaring back. So what you're looking at right now, check out this map, is a scenario in which you have nine different states in the U.S. that are above $5 a gallon at the moment. And then, guys, another 10. You see highlighted in dark red. The lighter red is the next 10 that are within striking distance of that. So 19 states are approaching or above $5 a gallon. OPEC has promised to ratchet up its production by about 650,000 barrels a day, but experts don't believe that's going to make a dent with all that Russian supply coming off the market. Let me say it back to you. Analysts also believe we're going to reach $6 a gallon by Labor Day. Now, when you talk about the factors that might be driving up prices, they're not going away anytime soon. Many folks might assume it's because of the European Union ratcheting up sanctions against Russian imports of oil and gas. Some 90% of those are going to be blocked by the end of 2022. But it's a combination of factors. So many families in America are hitting the road again right now. Demand is high for the summer travel season. On top of that, guys, oil producers have contracted their staffing by tens of thousands of employees, shut down wells because during the pandemic, demand all but vaporized, but our economy has come roaring back. So what you're looking at right now, check out this map, is a scenario in which you have nine different states in the U.S. that are above $5 a gallon at the moment. And then, guys, another 10, you see highlighted in dark red, the lighter red is the next 10 that are within striking distance of that. So 19 states are approaching or above $5 a gallon. OPEC has has promised to ratchet up its production by about 650,000 barrels a day, but experts don't believe that's going to make a dent with all that Russian supply coming off the market. Wow. Let me send it back to you. Of his business. It's making me um, have to charge, you know, add that additional cost um, to, to the client, and some of them are unhappy. I have to keep going, you know, I have to provide for my family, so uh, there's nothing I can do but keep working hard. And we also spoke with a gas analyst today who does expect the average price for regular here in Florida to reach $5 per gallon in the coming weeks. We have a list of resources to help you fight the rising fuel prices you can scan of his business. It's making me um, have to charge, you know, add that additional cost um, to, to the client. And some of them are unhappy. I have to keep going, you know, I have to provide for my family. So, uh, there's nothing I can do but keep working hard. And we also spoke with a gas analyst today who does expect the average price for regular here in Florida to reach $5 per gallon in the coming weeks. We have a list of resources to help you fight the rising fuel prices. You can scan this QR